Hello. Thank you for joining me again today. Um, I'm just here to give you a brief recap of the reflections for this forum's assignment. First, I would like to start off with a word of prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you for the work that we've done so far. I pray for my students that you give them extra grace, extra um, intellect, extra material to draw from, to write their papers and to express themselves fluently and accurately in writing. Bless their homes, their families, their jobs, their ministries. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you so much for joining me today. Again, I would just like to recap a little bit about what we were discussing this forum regarding family, dual parent, dual parent family, and single parent family. Who use the assistance of other family members. They may have an auntie, they may have a grandmother, or a family friend even. And that person acts as part of the family and part of uh, the decision-making process regarding the home and regarding raising the child. For example, uh, one of my questions to one of the students was, there is an example of a single parent in the Bible where Paul in particularly um, applauds that single parent uh, who worked with this child's grandmother to raise this child. And this child was Timothy, one of the writers of the epistles. So this is an aspect that I think the book could, uh, the book and all of our reading could have explored a little bit more the uh, aspect of the extended family and the importance of the extended family. I'm very interested in what you have to share about that. And I'm just asking you also to reflect on using the extended family when you do your work with families in the future. The Lord may have you working with um, families regarding family therapy or marriage therapy. Um, I, can, I can tell you that um, by drawing from other people in, that, in, that, uh, in your patients' lives, such as grandmother, grandfather, parents, uh, other siblings, this can assist um, in developing good relationships with your clients. And your clients need to connect to these people because it builds their social support system. So please pray about that. Pray about the extended family. It is just as important as the nuclear family. Thank you very much. And I wish you a very good day. And again, I look forward to reading more uh, of your writings and your thoughts in these coming weeks. God bless you.